Eric Lima here. You're watching not only my second YouTube channel, but also my YouTube blog show of 2018. It's known as EML77 TV. And this is episode number 30. How's everyone going out there? How's everyone doing? Well, got a bit of surprise for everyone here. A bit of surprise. Um, it's kind of a continuation from a couple of episodes ago when I talked about Toys R Us. Everybody knows the deal. Toys R Us uh, filed for bankruptcy. Um, they're going out of business. So everything's on sale. Of the 30% off. So if you haven't bought if you haven't bought something that you wanted, go there and get it now. Before it closes. So I went there today and I figured uh, the first when I first heard about it, I decided well, I want to go and get the certain item. It didn't have the certain item. So I figured ah, alright, I'll go home. I said, Well, I'll go back there today to see if they have uh, two DSs or three DS XLs, but hopefully they'll be on sale and all that good stuff. So, uh, so uh, I decided, well, I'll go there. Bad news is they didn't have any 2DSs or 3DSs on set. But the good news is the original item I wanted, they got. The WWE World Heavyweight Championship. So needless to say, I finally pulled a Ted DiBiase. Now, for those who don't know, in February 1988, um, Hulk Hogan successfully defeated Andre the Giant back at WrestleMania 3. Fast forward to 1988 in February, um, as he decided to defend the title against Andre the Giant. Ted DiBiase has been pestering Hogan to give him the title, offered him money, but Hogan said no. So, DiBiase had a plan, get Hogan to defend the title against Ted DiBiase. Against against Andre the Giant, Andre the Giant won and decided to sell the title to Ted DiBiase. And Ted DiBiase said he bought the belt. That's how it all began. And you know the whole story. Tal became vacant. WrestleMania four held a tournament. Macho Man Randy Savage won it. Uh, I'm kind of really excited about getting this uh, purchase. Um, this is really really cool. It cost me ninety bucks. It's always 10% off. Usually 100 bucks, 10% off. 90, 90 bucks. So, if you have 90 bucks, go out and get it. If you're a WWE fan, go out and get it. So, I can't wait. So, I bought this thing just in time for WrestleMania, too. How cool is that, right? I'm not going to WrestleMania, technically. But, you know, you know AJ Styles will be defending this championship against Shinsuke Nakamura. That, but the title is uh, a lot more real in this one. But it, it's, it's so realistic. Unbelievable. I never think I would hold a belt this big. I mean, personally, I was hoping they would sell the Intercontinental title. Because that's my favorite title of all time. Is the Intercontinental Championship. But this will do. Um, hey, you know. Uh, so, what I decided to do um, in honor of this going on. I'm going to give you a schedule of, up, of upcoming episodes. Alright. April the 5th. April the 5th, in an upcoming episode of my YouTube vlog show, EML77 TV, I will give you my predictions for NXT TakeOver New Orleans for the following Saturday. Yep, it's, 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 a week, it's a week from this Saturday, a week from today, next week. So, Thursday, the 5th of April, NXT TakeOver New Orleans picks and pre prediction picks. All right? Now, Friday, the following... The following day, Friday, I will give you my Raw prediction the, uh, prediction picks for the Raw side of, uh, of WrestleMania, for the Raw matches that are happening at WrestleMania. Then, then Saturday, then Saturday, I will give you the SmackDown uh, WrestleMania matches prediction picks. That way, it makes it easier, you know, makes, makes it easier and well organized and all that. So... So that's how it's going to be. So, so that is my update of the, um, update of the schedule. Hope you guys enjoy it. Um, if you want to make your picks too, um, please do comment when I put the videos up. Upload these videos. It's going to be a, it's going to be an exciting day. Seriously. Um, I can't believe it. The WWE World Heavyweight Title. I bought it. It's mine, Hogan. It's mine. <laughs> no one. Uh, is, uh, I'm just kidding, Hogan. Uh, this is uh, this is this is, belt is so surreal. It, it fits around a 46-inch waist, which I'm too big for, but I, I don't care. I really don't care. This is this is something else. This is 
and now they get these guys get these belts and now now it's like unbelievable this is unbelievable like i said i want the intercontinental title there we go the tickers up you can hold it like this you can you can hold it like this and go rob van dam yeah uh, this is a this is awesome. Oh, J.D. Martinez. Red Sox lost yesterday, six to four. They had a four game to nothing lead, I mean, a four nothing lead, four nothing lead, and a bullpen blew it. Joe Kelly and Carson Smith couldn't get it together. So, well, hopefully the Red Sox will have an opportunity here. David Price is on the mound, pitching very well. Um, so we'll see what happens here. And I'm looking. Come on. Oh, strike three. Uh, that's how it is. That's how it is. All right, so I'm really excited about this uh, championship belt. My final. My, the reason why I'm saying this uh, was it to do with Toys R Us. This is the final per my purchase of Toys R Us. I bought it there. Like I said, if you happen to be a little, if you're a WWE fan or wrestling fan, and go to your local Toys R Us and have enough money on you. You better go get one of these, man, before they're all gone and before the store closes down for good, man. Um, they're having sales right now, so if I were you, I'd go get one. So I'm going to have a lot of fun. So this is... Uh, so... Uh, Sorry. Oh, the Incredibles 2 is coming out June 15th. Unbelievable. Oh, I'm getting scoops every single day. As you know, The Rock's movie Rampage is coming out April the 13th. That's during my vacation time. So that means I'm going to go see the movie Rampage and possibly I'll do an episode of how, how the movie went. It would be really, really cool. Where am I going to see it? Anywhere but the Dartmouth Mall. I'm telling you right now. Been a rough... I right, first first week back from work, and I got another week to work, and then I go on vacation again. The reason why, you know, you're thinking, Eric, you already been on vacation uh, a couple weeks ago. Yeah, I know, but the fact of the matter is, I had to use up these vacation hours before May first. So it is, and plus, I couldn't I couldn't take them during the holidays because they don't want you doing doing that. Um, I couldn't take them during the winter because what what happens if it snows like crazy? You're needed in. So it's like, okay. Now, even though, despite the fact that I was told by my boss not to worry about the snowstorm, which I highly doubt we're going to see any more snowstorms. Uh, and it's, it's been, like I said, April 1st is going to be, it's going to be, April 1st is going to be nice in the 50s, so we don't have to worry about it. A lot of rain to get to all, melt all this, all these snow banks from the storm a couple weeks ago would be great. All right, it would be wonderful. So, anyways, uh, so I'm going to be looking forward to that. So, uh, and plus I know you've seen a lot of things happening, a lot of changes happen. I cannot tell you why, but you're going to have to tune, uh, just keep tuning into my show and find out what the heck is going on. I'm a very unpredictable guy, you know what I'm saying? It's really crazy. A lot of things are happening. So, uh, you know, a lot of things happen, a lot of good things happening. Just, uh, you know, just hang in there, hang tight and be patient, all right? Um, before I got to go, I got to go because my sister... Bought her, got herself another dog, and her fiance got herself another dog. Would you believe this? Three dogs they have. It's like, what's this craziness? I don't know. I like I said on my Facebook status, my family's insane. The insanity in my house has reached over nine thousand. You know, and if you don't get that, the anime joke, uh, Dragon Ball, you know, Vegeta, Goku, and all that. All right, then I'll see you guys later. Um, See you guys in episode 31. It's a little bit craziness here. Like I said, it's my, it's my life. My life's craziness. So, and guess what? The champ. Oh, the champ. That's right. I'm the champ now. <laughs> so, yeah, put it around my necklace like Doug, Bubba Ray Dudley. Oh, my gosh. It's so big. The champ, it's so big. And... <laughs> Woo! <laughs> Look at me. I'm the champ, man. I'm a champ. All right. Uh, I'll see you guys later. You, have, you guys have a wonderful night. And, uh... Stay blessed, guys, all right? Just got the title. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm the champ. All right. See you guys later. <laughs> have, a good, have a good night. Peace out, guys.